Welcome to our simplified tutorial on the cardiac hemodynamic perfusion cycle. This is how our heart works to keep us alive by ensuring our bodies get a constant supply of oxygenated blood. Let's break it down. First, deoxygenated blood returns to the heart from the rest of the body through two large veins called the superior and inferior vena cava. This blood enters the right atrium, one of the four chambers of the heart. Next, the blood crosses the tricuspid valve and enters the right ventricle, another chamber of the heart. From there, the blood is pumped through the pulmonary valve into the pulmonary artery, which carries it to the lungs. Here in tiny air sacs called alveoli, the blood picks up oxygen. Then this oxygen-rich blood returns to the heart via the pulmonary veins, entering the left atrium. The oxygenated blood then crosses the bicuspid or mitral valve and enters the left ventricle ready to be pumped out to the body. Finally, the blood is pumped through the aortic valve into the aorta. And from there, it travels throughout the body delivering vital oxygen to our cells. And that's the cardiac hemodynamic perfusion cycle in a nutshell. Thanks for watching.